What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for tuning in to another episode. I'm Mike from Slow Speed, and uh, we're gonna get on with this video. So right off the bat, you can already tell, I'm in the car because it's cold. Today we're gonna put on the M4 GTS hood. I highly recommend you do this with two people. I'm just rushing and not doing this the proper way because at least I would want, I would want to have some type of support on that side as well. So just, uh, yeah impatient want to get this done Nelson's is taking a bit long i'm going to go ahead and do is i'm going to go ahead and attack these two 13 millimeter bolts to go ahead and relieve the hood from the hinges now i forgot to mention uh well while we're here we might as well go ahead and just disconnect these clips disconnect the clips that actually go to the windshield washers i totally forgot about this this is a misstep i would recommend doing this first before you start loosening up anything so while you're uh, before go ahead and it's like a little notch tab right here you're going to go ahead and push this down and disconnect the electrical connector right here So now that we have this disconnected, which is the windshield washer, uh, motor activator, and I guess just the supply, I'm gonna go ahead and loosen up the hood. Now this is not required, but since I'm by myself, I'm gonna go ahead and lower it a little bit while I loosen it up so that the hood doesn't slide down and uh, damage the glass. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. So this looks different. Ain't no hood. Where's the hood? The hood is gone. Here comes Nelson. Jeez. Yeah, you can't see nothing in here. <laughs> it was crazy. You already took the hood off. Come on, hurry up, man. You're wasting time. I took it off myself. <laughs> Finally got Nelson here, the helping hand. But if you guys didn't understand what I said before, uh, basically, if you look at the hood, these two 13 millimeter bolts right here, this one I took off completely. That's, you have to keep this one a little tight so that uh, it won't pivot a little bit. And what you're gonna do is, if you're by yourself, you're gonna hold the hood up just a little bit and loosen this one, reach over here, loosen that one and pull the hood out just kind of like how you see me do it. Uh, the hood is not that heavy, but we'll go ahead and disconnect some of the things that we gotta take out of this hood, throw in a new GTS hood, and literally throw in a new GTS hood. Yo, you said 330, bruh. Huh? You said 330. I don't know. Don't lie, it looks nice like this. Oh, by the way, I forgot to show everybody. This is a failed attempt at making merch. So uh, yeah, this won't go anywhere, except for me, cause I just throw it on, cause it's really warm. Quality's nice, really warm. I will use this again, but I gotta come with a better design. So. Talk to your boy Nelson to help me make a better design than the ones I'll be making. Cause I just know it's more cold, boy. I just figured it out myself. <laughs> you gotta just squeeze these, grab the plastic piece only, and then just start loosening up like this. I'm gonna do it to the other side. What do you think? Is it gonna rain? These are the hinges. Purchased this on eBay. Look down below. Uh, on the last video, oh yeah, you can't see anything, but on, uh, <laughs> in the last, 
in the last video i put the link down below where i purchased it from to use they came from some of ebay i think i paid 70 bucks and 77 cents but they come off of a i want to say carbon black but it's a it's basically a blue comes off of a blue f30 so uh yeah, if you guys comment and say, oh, this doesn't match your car's blue, I think I realized that. And uh, two, uh, I don't think anybody would see this unless you pop the hood. And then it's like, damn, maybe I need to paint these one day. Ah, well, not right now. <laughs> it's cold. <laughs> but yeah, this is how the hinge is supposed to work. I don't know how the other one bent. Maybe it bent. Uh, maybe one, one of these pieces bent. Uh... And he also supplied me with hood struts. These are used as well. I don't know how long they would last. These are supposed to be really easy. Pop in, pop out. And oh yeah, they look like they work pretty good because I can't do it with my own hands. So <laughs> uh, we're gonna go ahead and disassemble now. It's two more 13s, just kind of like how we took off the hood. Just two more 13s uh, to take off the hinges and we should be good. Slap these on. We're just gonna throw the hood on. Do a little fitment because right here, obviously, are sort of kind of adjustable. Yo, you want to throw the GTS hood on and just see the test fitment wise purposes? Let's do it. All right, yeah. Let's. Because if I don't do have it. to use that, that's wonderful. I don't know if I can return it, but. It's EBA, right? Mm hmm. Yep. If you can return it? Yep. Got 30 days. This is the old one, all right? You can see it's messed up, it's bent. It went a little bit too far back like it's supposed to. A little wobbly, unstable. Unfortunately, these ones are blue. Don't match the car whatsoever, but uh, yep. Um, yeah, if I'm really honest with you, I don't even know if I'll get it painted. I'm not even gonna lie to you, but uh, the black hood goes on, which we gotta, yo, it's getting dark. We gotta hustle, so. <laughs> nah, I told him, I was like, yo, I'd just rather you not touch the car. He's like, yeah. Hey, Hold on, yo, yo, just hold it right there, both of y'all. After that, take this off. I'm not my way home, man. Well, I'm taking out time, dude. I'm broke. I'm taking out time, dude. Oh, he's stupid. Yo, hold on. Yo, Nelson, keep your time with this. I'm gonna start doing this. I'm gonna start doing this. I got time, man. Here. No problem. I'm gonna start doing this. I'm gonna start doing this. Oh, my bad. Good shoulders, you feel me? Okay. We're all sensitive. Yeah. <laughs> damn. That shit. Oh. Nah, that shit looks fire though. God damn. I gotta, I gotta align it though. Yeah. Might not happen today. That's it. Cause this side, this hood gotta come this way a little bit more. Yeah. So it's, it's too cold for all that right now. So here you have it guys, the hood is installed, obviously you could tell, uh, yeah those are the blue 335 screws, still gotta get it aligned. It's about like a week later, I filmed several videos after this and totally forgot to get back to this one. So uh, bear with me, uh, you guys are gonna see some clips of the hood or some shots of the hood, looks super dope. Uh, gotta do a couple things though, I gotta fix this bleeder valve thingy and uh, run to the shop because we gotta get more stuff done. But just stay tuned with me guys uh yeah just wanted to close out this hood video like i was saying i have not put the mat up here i don't really see any holes where it would go but the oem i think it's like a sound deadening material i don't know i kind of like the way this m looks anyway might just keep it like that uh another thing that i did not put up yet was the windshield washers so um i'm not gonna make a separate video of putting everything on there i'll probably just throw it on there in another video and uh, yeah, we'll move on from there. Uh, you get my thoughts on the hood so far. I drove around with it. I like it. It's very, very different. Extremely noticeable even from the driver's seat. Uh, you can see the really big hump. And the slit, well, I, I haven't put anything there. Uh, it's a big hole right now uh, because when it goes in for paint, I don't want them to have to, you know, uh, pop it back out. Maybe break a couple tabs or pins or something like that. So I went ahead and I just left that out. The rain's not too bad. I'll be honest with you. It gets right here. Uh, I've thought about kind of making putting like duct tape here or something to close it off but I don't know I mean 
I think I may, I think later on down the road I might need him. What is this? Oh. I think later on down the road I'll see, judging by how bad it gets, but I don't know. I might just rock out because I might have a place to put this car actually, so uh, like enclosed garage style. So I might just rock out with that as is and see how things go. So thank you guys for watching. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, and uh, peace out. Comment below, tell me what you think.